Good day and welcome back to the channel. Today we've got our second Undisputed video. I'm using Rocky Marciano and I'm versing Deontay Wilder in an online fight. All right. Now you have to wait to the end of this video to see the insane comeback KO and you don't want to miss it. You will absolutely love it. Probably one of the best fights I've had in this game and the most fun I've had to be honest. It was just back and forth, and I could feel his power hitting me the whole time, but man, Rocky Marciano has a chin, and he's got that dull organ in him, you know what I'm talking about. You look at his x-rays, and he's got two pit bulls in there, you know? Alright, starting off the match, starts off pretty fast as you can see, just sitting in the pocket throwing, showing him that I'm not scared of his power. I'm a bit quicker. And my short arms will work well close up. Get the first rock. Can I drop him? Go to the body, head. Trying to mix it up. And I dropped him. First round. Let's go. He looks like he's asleep, but he'll pop right back up. I love the knockdown animations and just how you get up in this game over Fight Night. I feel like you can get up more in this game than Fight Night Champion. If you've ever played Fight Night Champion, after about the fourth knockdown, it's legit impossible to get back up on the fifth. Like you have to, you go slow motion, there's just no way in hell. In this game, it feels like you've got more of a chance of getting up after getting knocked down a few times. It still is very difficult, but... We're all still learning. We're both trying to counter, but he's trying to counter me a lot closer than he should with Deontay Wilder. With his reach, he should be about one or two steps back and she popped me from there, but he's not. Got me with a few clean ones there. And that's the round. Yeah, I'm looking good. I think I won that round personally. Obviously I did, I dropped him. But I mean, I was just laying the cleaner punches, like the two straights in a row. Ready? Boom. Left hook. Right hook. Dang it. Got him a nice little body shot. Rocked him again to the body. I love that little run forward. But if he just throws a straight out, I'm wide open. I'm going to let him recover. I wasn't able to finish. I'm going to try and take it a bit slower. Boom, boom. Watch out, watch out. This is post commentary, by the way. Oh, and he got me with two beautiful uppercuts. They dazed me good. He's trying to hunt me down. Say, no way, Jose. Back off me, dude. He's on their bronze bomber bombs, my G. Way too far away. Whiff. Come on, dude. Ding dong. Give him a nice little straight. My hook was way too short, and he's just jabbing the shit out of my face. <laughs> just jab spamming the shit out of me right now. He found something that worked. Jesus Christ. I could not get away from that jab. He knew my own jab and rocked him, actually. That's hilarious. I feel like in this particular fight, we'll rock each other much more than I have in other fights, and that's why I found it way more entertaining. For some reason, the punches just felt like that, and a little bit of extra power. Got me with the jab again. Ooh, that right hand crunched me. And he's leaning, trying to throw him like Deontay in real life. And I survived the round, surprisingly, without getting knocked down. Alright, third, ding ding ding, here we go. See how it does. See how I do, see how it does. English, love it. <laughs> He's just bop bopping me in the head with that fucking jab. Back off, dude. Feel like a 90 inch reach, alright? Heavyweights do look much bigger nowadays, but I guess it just depends with each generation. 
He had George Foreman, Klitschko, and stuff back in the day. Now you got Wilder and Fury. There's always some big boys in the heavyweight division. And you love to see it. Ooh. How to get a little rock. He throws a big right hand. And I'm just getting him right now. Then one, two will land him. Especially that two. Nice uppercut. Dropped him. Let's go. So I dropped him twice. See, I don't know if this is a comeback carry because he does drop me in the later round. But I do drop him before he drops me, so it's just it's just a good fight really. It's not really a comeback by me because I'm winning so far. If anything it'll be a comeback by him. Nice jab. That's the one thing he's hit me nice with. He needs to let his right hand go though. If he can hit me with the jab, he can hit me with his right. I feel like he looks like he's using the buttons as well, where I use the toggle. Just trying to lean in. To be honest, his jab feels more powerful than my right hand, but it probably is, to be fair. Deontay Wilder, every punch he throws is pretty damn strong. I'd say him and Francis and Garner are the biggest punches in the world. Can't argue with that really, can you? Imagine a fight between them two. It'd just be one of them waiting to land a bomb. And Deontay, I think, would ruin Francis being he's a boxer if it was in a boxing fight. Wow. He hit me with two left hooks and then a right and dropped me. Let's get back up though. We ain't kidding around. Come on, Rocky. Let's go. I'm up, ref. Come on. I'm good. I'm good. Let's keep it going. Awesome all. A minute 45 to go. Oh, nice dodge. The count is a beautiful rocky at the moment. And that big overhand right. Flash KO. How good is that? I'll replay that. That was just a beautiful overhand right. Flash KO. Good night, Wilder. God damn. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.